Welcome back to Arc Tutorials. This is HTML full tutorial series for absolute beginners. In today's episode, we will learn about headings element in HTML. Very, very important. There is absolutely, I think, no website which will not have any headings. And hence, it's important as a beginner to learn about headings that you want to incorporate in your pages. Let's get started. This is part five of the series. If you haven't checked out the first four parts, I'll request you to kindly do so, if, especially if you're a beginner. That would help you set the basics and the foundation for the tutorial chapters that are coming ahead. All right, so let's talk about headings in HTML. HTML headings are titles or subtitles that you want to display on a web page. Headings can range from H1 to H6. H1 defines the biggest font or rather I would say the important heading in the page and H6 being the least important or the smallest uh, heading in the page. Why headings are important? Because search engines like Google, or Bing, they all use headings to index and structure our web page. If you look at any uh, website or a blog or a content management system, everything will have a main heading H1 then the content sections will have h2 then followed by h3 and so on and so forth based on the importance of that sections what it means is that you have to have headings in your web page especially if you want to make them search engine friendly that being our basic understanding of headings let's get started into coding a quick recap this is where we were at in the last episode where we learned about HTML tag every tag should have an open and a closing tag head HTML will have the main structure inside that we will have head inside that we will have body tag and today we are learning about headings okay so what I'll do I'll just refresh this page and make it empty there is nothing absolutely nothing now and a quick note if you are following this series you should know what is doc type if you know what is doc type and you have gone through it and you have a solid understanding do let me know in the comment section all right so h1 is the heading to write headings okay h followed by the number okay it can range from h1 to h6 h1 being the highest important or the top most headline so i'm going to say my first web page and save it go to the page and just refresh and you will see that web page title coming up. Same way, I'm going to add H2, the second headline. Now a quick question to you, can we have more than one H1 in a page? Obviously, yes, you can. Second, okay, headline. Oh, second should not confuse you, so I'm going to put it the word again. So you see, that means you can have any number of headlines in the page okay doesn't matter and it's all about your page structure how you want to design it similarly you have h3 third headline similarly you have fourth headline instead of copy paste we can just write it it would be much faster fourth headline fifth headline and like that we have till 6 at 6 now you will see that each of these will have see the size of the this is h1 h2 h2 again 3 4 5 and 6 if you see the font size is also going low okay so the ideal way your page structure will be is it will have one h1 multiple h2s multiple h3s and then so on right that's how any news article that you can pick at CNN New York Times Times of India they will have the same structure you'll have one main heading followed by subsections in it so that's where headings are used and headings um, can go with some attributes okay like we have seen in the earlier episode attribute lesson we can use background color for now I'm going to use this and make it the first web page you can style similarly all the headings for now I want you to use only background color because I'll be covering all of this in detail this is only for your warm-up okay so please follow that 
and use some good colors okay don't go about whether it looks nice or not at this point of time our I will take you there where we will start professional looking websites but first brick by brick we will go there okay don't rush today focus on learning only about headings that's what I am showing you now okay so headings we have seen they are the most important h1 being the most important h6 being the least important search engines will use this to index the structure and content of the website so plan accordingly how a h1 uh, would look and all that we will I will give you some examples we'll do some live coding also we will we will learn that so we will go there so remember there are six types of headings h1 to h6 that's all you should learn in today's episode about headings in HTML I hope you're following I hope you're learning do let me know in the comment section if you have any doubts or queries I'll be more than happy to help you I want to see you succeed okay Thank you so much for joining. See you in the next episode. We will learn about paragraphs in HTML. Thank you.